Hello and welcome to Lil Graphics Factory. This is live care program that comes to you on weekly basis, live on Facebook every Wednesday at 8 p.m. And uh, for other programs, they are available on YouTube, Real Graphics Factory. Welcome. Today, uh, we are discussing a very interesting topic. We are talking about unhealthy competition, unhealthy competition. And before we get to invite our guest today, I, I would wish you to uh, pour down on this. The other day, I departed from Naivasha on my way to Nakuru, and um, just past uh, uh, the, the Daramea factory, I, someone passed me with a vehicle, driving very fast, and uh, the vehicle was looking a little bit old, so I, I thought of uh, trying to drive a little a bit fast to, to prove a point. And of course, when we talk of uh, uh, driving fast to uh, prove a point, we are talking of dangerous driving. But just a few kilometers down the road at uh, the KCC junction, this guy just diverted and went his own way. So I was left on the road uh, running or uh, competing with myself. Just put down on this as uh, we get to a discussion on unhealthy competition, unhealthy competition. And today we are joined by our guest and um, he will introduce himself as we get to, uh, before we get to uh, start our discussion. So Karibu Sana, our guest. Thank you. My name is Josh Fatmoya Karuki. My friends call me Stress Free. Welcome our viewer. So, thank you. When we talk of uh, unhealthy competition, I know uh, from experience uh, as a person and also uh, I've just uh, narrated my experience and I say this is something to ponder upon and uh, you may be having your personal experience or even you may have uh, been able to come across um, incidences of health and healthy competition and maybe it's good that um, as uh, we introduce this topic to, to get uh, from your perspective, to get to an understanding of what uh, you view as unhealthy competition. Okay. According to me, unhealthy competition is whereby you are doing something, imitating someone, or beyond your reach, mm -hmm. with the intention to get to a certain limit which you are not capable of achieving. Mm -hmm. That is unhealthy competition. Mm -hmm. uh, it means that, uh, of course, f everyone has a certain capacity to tackle something. But when uh, one starts uh, to go past that capacity, in order to compete with someone, then it becomes unhealthy. And um, who are these people that are so much prone to <laughs> unhealthy competition? Okay. Severally, everyone is prone. Everyone, according to human understanding, everyone is prone because everyone needs a successive life. Uh, it's a certain things that a person admires in life. So everyone is prone. But according to your question, there are specific people who can be more prone. Mm -hmm. uh, according to me, mm -hmm. all the, the way I interact with the people, the most prone people, I'm sorry to say, mm -hmm. women are so prone to unhealthy competition. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you will appro you, you approve it or discredit it, but women are so much prone to unhealthy competition. Also, the, the young age, mm -hmm. this young generation, mm -hmm. they are so prone to unhealthy competition. Mm -hmm. But you get a person 40 years and above, even women when they get to that age, most they relax mm -hmm. and realize that the speed they are going with, mm -hmm. they reach nowhere. Mm -hmm. But young women and then mm -hmm. young generation, both males and females, mm -hmm. uh, you have just given us example. I don't know where I can classify you, <laughs> yes. young and old. You are you grown to that bracket. Yeah. Maybe the, 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 the person you are chasing with your vehicle, he was minding his own business. Yes. But you, out of curiosity, or I don't know, out of ignorance, yes. started 
driving very fast. Mm -hmm. So according to me, or uh, in my view, or what I have seen with our community, mm -hmm. mostly, mm -hmm. I don't want to be, to be judged harshly by anyone, mm -hmm. but women and young generation. Yes. Yes. And um, there is a point uh, that uh, comes in mind when we talk of this uh, issue of competition. And uh, the aspect of being ambitious and um, indulging oneself in an unhealthy competition, uh, maybe we need to put a line between the two, um, indulging or involving oneself in an unhealthy competition and um, being ambitious. Where do we put a line between the two? Okay. If you get a person who is ambitious, yes. when you are being ambitious, mm -hmm. that means that you have a plan mm -hmm. with your life. Mm -hmm. And if you are ambitious and you have a plan, mm -hmm. your plan works very well. Mm -hmm. But those people who fail mm -hmm. because they are ambitious, mm -hmm. and then they involve themselves in unhealthy competition, Yes. It means this one, that they were not ambitious. They were trying to copy someone who already uh, is ambitious. Mm -hmm. So you are copying someone who is ambitious, but you, are, you, you are not ambitious. Mm -hmm. So you are copying someone. That one uh, doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. And finally, mm -hmm. it leads to a lot of disappointment. Uh -huh. So there is a difference between a person who is ambitious mm -hmm. and a person who admires a person, mm -hmm. another person who is uh, ambitious. Which therefore means that uh, we need to come back to our own selves and finding out, before I copy, am I uh, gifted in that area? Am I good at that? Is that my purpose in life? Or am I just uh, running helter-skelter, trying to copy others and trying to catch up with others, yet they are in their own race of life? And... Um, this brings us to the effects of unhealthy competition. I know, of course, there, there must be uh, effects uh, uh, on what comes out when uh, the outcomes of uh, unhealthy competition, maybe in the society, economically, uh, even spiritually, or even health-wise. Okay. Yeah. There is a, a musician who sang that copying each other yeah. in life yeah. read something that is very 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 bad mm -hmm. I just like that and one thing that leads to uh, as a result of copying people mm -hmm. or unhealthy competition because unhealthy competition is whereby that uh, if it is in business unhealthy competition just help the consumer mm -hmm. but you as a business person mm -hmm. you get nothing mm -hmm. because now if we get we are selling this phone mm -hmm. we bought it at four thousand mm -hmm. i sell it at 42 just to get 200 mm -hmm. and another person comes in and sells it at 4100 to get 100. Mm -hmm. finally one person might go home uh -huh. that one i classify that as economically uh -huh. economically mm -hmm. it brings someone yes it brings someone mm -hmm. Because if you went there, mm -hmm. selling that something, mm -hmm. or the commodity you are selling, mm -hmm. at a lower price, mm -hmm. uh, to send the other person home, mm -hmm. where do we get, you, you get, if there is no profit, yes. you have people working at mm -hmm. your station, mm -hmm. you have rent, yes. and you have your life. Mm -hmm. So economically, you are going to drain yourself. Maybe yes. the, the, the capital, you borrowed the capital to work. So economically, it ruins someone. That yes. is business. Yes. Come to a person who is not in business. There are people who compete even with passions, and, are, mm -hmm. and especially women. Mm -hmm. Men, men, they are few. <clears throat> they were few, but especially women. They are competing with fashion. You get this ready, he's working, he's employed. You're just a house girl. Mm -hmm. You're just a mere person mm -hmm. who gets just peanuts somewhere. Mm -hmm. And then you see this person mm -hmm. goes with this new fashion. Mm -hmm. You just go and get the new fashion. Yes. This person have planned for his money. Mm -hmm. That's why he went for this. Mm -hmm. And you, you never know, uh, you don't have that enough money. Yes. You go for that expensive thing, mm -hmm. you go for that unnecessary thing, mm -hmm. what will happen to you? You drain yourself financially, yes. you are drained. Mm -hmm. And what will happen? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you find yourself so down, 
even sometimes you find yourself, uh, let me just put it there. That will lead to something, uh, another effect, psychological yes. effect. Yes. Because uh, when you are doing financially, you, your life goes down. Mm. You have even to move from the house you are. You have to, to, to pretend mm. that the life you are living, mm. it, is, it is okay, but it's not okay. Mm. So emo uh, that one is emotional, emotional, emotional yes. effect. Yes. You, you start even hiding. Mm. You started a big business. The business is gone. Mm -hmm. I have seen many people moving from that place, going to another place because already mm -hmm. is affected emotionally, mm -hmm. psychologically, and mm -hmm. economically. Yes. So just that unhealthy competition mm -hmm. leads to those three things. Mm -hmm. yes. And I think you have also pointed out uh, something on the, how you interact with others. Because when you get drained, when you get into frustration, of course, your interaction with others gets trained and therefore socially this unhealthy competition is of course leading to something but um, there is this aspect that you've mentioned on emotional psychological effects and I, I think uh, from your experience you must have come across people who've have added up uh, with mental health issues because of the root cause being unhealthy competition maybe uh, you can share your experiences. Okay, I forgot to add something. Mm -hmm. That apart from economical, social, uh, and um, uh, psychological, there is another. Even there are others who suffer spiritual yes. effect. Yes. Because if uh, with the current trade, yes. you are seeing even pastors coming up with churches. He go and takes a own. He build a big church because his friend pastor build a church. My friend, if you are not seen. An auctioneer <laughs> auctioning a church mm -hmm. I've witnessed mm -hmm. the church is gone mm -hmm. because he just uh, first took the title he built a very good house mm -hmm. uh, that's not a personal but the church let me not call it a house mm -hmm. but he did not have the, the Christian in that church cannot afford to put such but because a fellow pastor they were in the same college have put a very good church mm -hmm. many Christians are coming in he goes on that is a spiritual effect because within no time you find there is no church. Mm -hmm. The place has been sold, mm -hmm. and then they go to a plot. They start. They start yeah. uh, uh, again from zero. Mm -hmm. There are members of those churches. You see, we are blessed differently. Yes. You can. You go to a church. There is a person who can um, donate mm -hmm. even the the, 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 the the a good sum of money. Mm -hmm. Other they can donate. Even they can give them the reverend mm -hmm. a full vehicle. Mm -hmm. with everything yes maybe you cannot even afford <clears throat> to buy a pen mm -hmm. for your church mm -hmm. you have to accept yourself yes others mm -hmm. now there comes the spiritual challenges mm -hmm. you find others saying this church belongs to the rich people uh -huh. I have to go to a church mm -hmm. of my class no mm -hmm. no no mm -hmm. God did put you there with a reason yes and there is no uh, I, I, I like quoting our tradition they, 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 we say that even in uh, your teeth, mm -hmm. it's not uniform. Yes. Even your fingers, mm -hmm. are, they are not uniform. Yes. So, and they have to stay there. Mm -hmm. Yes? Mm -hmm. They help each other Without because they are not uniform. Mm -hmm. If they are uniform, yes. they, 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 they cannot work. Yes. So, you find that there are many people, mm -hmm. even the church or the, any congregation, mm -hmm. that they lose their spiritual cord because of unhealthy competition. Others you get in the church, people are competing, even in church, you find people competing on fashion. Mm -hmm. Yes, you want to, to, to surprise other uh, uh, fellow Christian that you can just uh, be mm -hmm. in, uh, updated with the current uh, fashion. Yes. You find, in fact, I can add something on that. You can find even family breakdown. Mm -hmm. Because if you get one partner that he goes with fashion so much, or he's, he have, it can be the husband yes. or the wife. Yes. If, the, uh, if the husband go, have this behavior of unhealthy competition, mm -hmm. uh, maybe he's not a Christian, mm -hmm. they meet somewhere along the weekend, he has to prove to the other yes. that he can feed them. Mm -hmm. Maybe they are serving drinks, mm -hmm. he can afford. Yes. And he's threatening his pocket. Yeah. What will happen? He, he goes there, he makes the, 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 the friends very happy. Mm -hmm. What about the family? When he goes home, yes. he's just marrying, but they have nothing in the 
fuck it. Yeah. So what will happen? One partner will give up. Mm -hmm. uh, the same case mm -hmm. to already. Yes. You get, I have seen ladies, I don't know if you know about these chamas, mm -hmm. women group, they come together, they, mm -hmm. they, 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 they <coughs> banking. Mm -hmm. So you, I have seen, you get, I give this one as an example. I have seen a, a woman go and have a good sum of money mm -hmm. from the chamas mm -hmm. and comes put out, he have very good, very good house. Yes. He have very good business, yes. but remember, this business, you have not studied it well. Yes. You have just gone because the friends are taking the money from Chamas and coming, putting something, he just do the same. Mm -hmm. So, when the, the Chama, you know, there is nothing for free in this world. Mm -hmm. When the time expires, the Chama people come to you correct their, yes. there is no money. Mm -hmm. You know, I have seen a woman being told, pack and go. Yes. You never told me that you borrowed money. Mm -hmm. So, that one, the family, Break down. down. So yes. unhealthy competition, it can lead, it's only that we don't have time, but mm -hmm. unhealthy competition leads to many, many, many things. Yeah. Yes. But I like one point that uh, you've talked about, that we are in life as individuals, and uh, we are created differently, and we are in each person is in a different race in life. And um, you've mentioned something of on about focus. When you start copying, when you start competing in an unhealthy manner, you end up losing your focus. And you end up missing to accomplish what you are created to accomplish. And uh, this brings us to um, the, the, the point on self-diagnosis. How what are maybe a few, like four or five pointers on um, that I can know that I'm not doing what I was created to do, but I'm running here and there, trying to copy others, adding up in what we are terming as unhealthy competition. How can I self-diagnose if I'm involving myself in unhealthy competition? That's fall on... Uh, self-awareness mm -hmm. or identity yes that fall on that category yes and in this world anyone no one uh, everyone has a gift yes if you don't know your gift mm -hmm. that brings the biggest mistake mm -hmm. and that's due to copying and copying mm -hmm. and if you don't you want to know that you are not doing the right thing mm -hmm. We say um, money yes. is a reward mm -hmm. of solving someone's problem. problem yes. <laughs> Even the salary, you are solving someone's problem because that person has employed you. Yes. So you have solved his problem yes. and then he rewards you rewards. at the end of. Mm -hmm. So if you want to know that you are not doing the right thing, mm -hmm. one, if what you are doing is not rewarding you, yes. You are in the wrong tunnel. Mm -hmm. If what we are doing, mm -hmm. you are getting nothing. Mm -hmm. You are on the wrong note. Yes. So, the best way to know if you are headed somewhere, mm -hmm. check if you are making any progress. Mm -hmm. Is it in business? Mm -hmm. Are you making progress? Mm -hmm. Is it in uh, family setup? Mm -hmm. Are you making any progress? Because I believe that each day, Yes. Brings up a new thing in your life. Mm -hmm. If you are doing nothing, maybe <clears throat> you are stuck in that business for a long period. Mm -hmm. You started the wrong business because your friend was making profit. In yes. fact, I hate that one. I hate it. That you get you copy your friend, he, he have, he's, he's doing this, he's getting money. My friend, mm -hmm. you don't know the source of money. Yes. You can see that person there. Uh, let me let me let me give you uh, an example. Yes. I had uh, uh, a young lady who told me about a story told me that they, 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 they started a business mm -hmm. because their neighbor was doing so well. Mm -hmm. So they said, let us, we are going to start this business. Mm -hmm. They had a, a restaurant. Mm -hmm. Hi, he's trained. Yes. I wondered, how do these people survive? Mm -hmm. You know, ladies are very good in interaction. Yes. Uh, she decided to approach the other lady yes. and asked, how how do you copy with this environment, mm -hmm. uh, with this restaurant? Mine is dying. Yes. Told my friend, 
do you know what we do? Yes, we, we serve there with my husband, yes. But my husband, my friend, uh, that time they, they were not in good relationship. <coughs> mm -hmm. yes? yes? So, uh, he was poor, he, she was like pouring out. Mm -hmm. we, we perform the, uh, or we, we do the work at the restaurant during the day. Mm -hmm. But at night, my husband goes around. Yes. Goes around, you mean what? He goes around in the other houses checking what? And is there. <laughs> yeah. So, we always have constant income, whether yeah. there are people not eating in the mm -hmm. restaurant. And what they get there, they be, the husband was going, breaking, mm -hmm. uh, breaking uh, stores, mm -hmm. coming with the unga, coming yes. in the fat, uh, using in the in restaurant. Hotel, yeah. But you, you are buying. That person sells a chapati for 10 bob. Mm -hmm. You sell 10 bob. My friend, you are buying unga, he's stealing unga. So, at, at, at last, <laughs> yeah. who is going to suffer? Yes. So, coping another person. Yeah. In fact, let me say this one. What I have come to realize in life, coping another person, you have no any blessing. Yes. I believe that, you know what? Mm -hmm. According to me, yes. please don't judge me. God does not answer prayer. Don't judge me. Let me finish my statement. Yes. He answers the motive of the prayer. Uh -huh. <laughs> I have seen you are surprised yes. what I'm yes. saying. Yes. Uh, God answers the yes. motive of the prayer. If I, if I come, I kneel down and I pray God. God, I need just what? Eh? To be bankrupt, mm -hmm. so that they can buy that house. Uh -huh. That one cannot happen. Uh -huh. You know, our God is so generous. Why don't you just take your personal prayer? God bless me. Yes. Don't, I even don't say that God bless me like just that. No, mm -hmm. God bless me. Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. You know, I like I like um, the, this woman in the operating. When he went to God, eh, the, 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 he said, God, bless me with a boy. Yes. He was specifically went to God. When I go to heaven, I must greet this woman. Yes. God, he did not go say that God bless me, the woman, so so that Penina can see mm -hmm. I have a boy, I have a child. No, yes. he never bothered. He went to God. God, give me a boy. Give me a boy. Yes. Was he given? She was. She was given a boy. Yes. So most people they they they, they check on the status of the others. Mm -hmm. They copy the others, and that's why people are not blessed. Do you know? Even when commodity, commodity uh, are high, uh, when I go down, I don't pray God that God help me, or God may, may you help the prices to fall down. I have never prayed that. Mm -hmm. When I kneel down, I pray God give me money so yes. that even when a commodity goes very up, I can afford Still because even the owner of the commodity, they are praying that mm -hmm. God to sustain that high price so that he can make profit. Make profits. I, I like there's a, a lot of points that we can get from that in terms of self-diagnosis. You will get to know that you are in an unhealthy competition if at first you don't know you are created to do what. You are in an unhealthy competition when you are literally just copying others. We regardless of getting to know what exactly are they doing? The third, even the, your prayer, I like that point. You'll get to know that you are involving yourself in an unhealthy competition if your motives are just but bad. And I really like that. Then, if I self-diagnose myself and see that this is all that I've been doing in life, what then should I do? Okay. Yeah. An army, when they, uh, or, or an army, when they are approaching their enemy, mm -hmm. and then they attack, what did they do? They retaliate. They retreat, yeah. So the best thing, when you discover that you have harmed your life, mm -hmm. you have gone the wrong way, mm -hmm. sit down. Yes. Take note mm -hmm. that I was misled because I copied someone. Mm -hmm. I misused my resources because I was living my own life. Mm -hmm. I never followed my plan. Mm -hmm. So, know your mistake. Accept. Yes. yes. I like talking about acceptance. Mm -hmm. Accept that I have made that mistake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> After you accept, you say, where can I stretch to? Mm -hmm. What is my limit? Limit, yes. Do you know one thing? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, God made even the poor people. I, I was reading somewhere in the Bible, mm -hmm. and uh, it was written that 
God is the God of the poor people. So I, I ask myself, so we have even God knows there is poor people. God is the God of rich people. So <laughs> maybe you are made to be poor. And you are struggling to get rich, my friend. You are going to kill yourself. Maybe God wants you to stay like that. Well, but I don't say that you don't try. You yes. have to keep trying. Okay, let me go back to my point. This structure. Uh, in phone, you say, <laughs> restore factory fact uh, uh, setting. Uh, yes. Restore factory fact setting. Yes. You know your phone when it just uh, want to die out of viruses and whatever setting. Mm -hmm. Restore. Start again. Yes. I've seen people who are started again. Mm -hmm. Do it well. Without wrong motive. Yes. Without wrong motive. Mm -hmm. Without checking anyone. Mm -hmm. Without trying to disapprove anyone. Yes. Trying to make your life mm -hmm. the way it should be. Mm -hmm. Trying to better yourself. Yes. God is watching you. You see, this person wants to better mm -hmm. himself. Yes. This person wants to make a good life without harming anyone. Yes. So, put your plan down. Mm -hmm. uh, there, are, there are things we say that what is your plan this year? Mm -hmm. Put your uh, plan in five years. I want to achieve this. Yes. I want to have married, to have children, mm -hmm. to build a house. Mm -hmm. So if you get on on your way, you get a person telling you to buy a vehicle, will you? Uh, you have a plan. before before you finish this plan, you cannot. Yes. If you get you see a friend, your friend have uh, purchased something that you cannot afford mm -hmm. will you divert your attention no because you have a, a plan, a plan. Yes. if you give a structure a funding mm -hmm. you give the plan of a house what or even if he had seen a good house somewhere else mm -hmm. he follows your your yeah, plan, plan. Yes. build it there because yes. the house is yours mm -hmm. so this plan help you not to divert mm -hmm. your resources yes your spiritual cord yes so you are focused. Mm -hmm. So the main thing here is focus. Focus. So yeah. after you go back to where you lost your step, you focus on your future. You focus. And remember, even in the last uh, time we said, you forget about the past. Yes. I repeat that one. Mm -hmm. Forget about that one. Mm -hmm. You are living a, a, on a competition. You forget yes. that one and say, I am focusing and you will achieve. Ah, thanks so much. That brings us to the very thing that we started with. When you get to start running, and you're running towards the wrong direction, it doesn't matter the speed at which you will go at, you are going to end up in the wrong destiny. Don't involve yourself in an unhealthy competition. And you were created with a purpose in life. Sit down, self-diagnose, and then if you discover that you're involving yourself in unhealthy competition, retreat, sit down, and refocus. And that way, you will lead a fruitful life. Continue following us at Real Graphics Factory on Facebook and on YouTube, Real Graphics Factory. This is Life Care Program. For any comments, just drop them in any of these uh, uh, platforms, and we will uh, get to discuss with you. If you need any help, still, just drop. Reach out and we shall discuss. And see that at the end of the day, we are living a life that we are created to live. Thank you very much for joining us today and sharing us uh, with us that wisdom. God bless you. Did you like the above video? Click subscribe and uh, enjoy more videos from Real Graphics Factory. I am C. Sairo TMT is a member and uh, I urge all of you to stay safe during these trying times, sanitize and also use your masks, stay quarantined, stay safe, Real Graphics Factory, TMT event. God bless you.